Mercenary, you have news? That explains the reports I received from my scouts. Governor Keshu is wise. Gideon isn't as defensible as Leowin. A battle inside the city limits will cause... I'll rally the Ivory Brigade here in Leowin, and we'll meet you at... The cultists seem to have moved away from Leowin. Play the army you're dealt, right? Or, if we're being totally honest, I'm as nervous as the last leaf on the tree on the final day of fall. I'm... Whew! I mean, I knew that. It just makes me feel better to hear you say it. Like a storm drawing near, Vandasia's forces come. Time... I want you inside the fort near the guard. I expect a two-pronged assault. The bulk of... Brigadines, take your positions! The enemy could arrive at any time! Evely, take the ambitions to the guardhouse! Vandasia's forces, Captain Rianne? I just received word. The Waking Flame has arrived, and they have portal mages with them. Evely, take the ambitions to the guardhouse. I'll protect them. You stay here and defend the courtyard. Ha! to our target!
Lord, you're here. A little help, please. Come and take us. There are more of these abominations on the balcony. Change your strategy. Ambitions? Tangled roots, what a mess! Over here, mercenary! Vandesia's forces... they're everywhere! Sombrin, I sense more of them. They're coming! All of you, under the shield! to move stay close Keep going! Courage brings Move. victory. Oh, 
something. You're only delaying the inevitable. Monster! Because of you, our parents are dead! They were the chosen of Meron's Dagon. Rewarded beyond their station. I'm going to kill you, Vandasia! Who shall I sacrifice first? Perhaps the sister. You leave Kalia alone, you bastard! Gastron! Let me help you fulfill your purpose. Destron! No! Lord Dagon, I return to you the power of this ambition. Let the realms merge so you may walk among us. Sky! And Merun's Dagon! How is he here? This is my opposition. How easily I shall crush them. Into the keep, quickly. The worlds are merging, Sombrin. There is no escape when you talk. I hate you! Just leave us alone! Talia, you can't unleash your power like that. You could lose control. What does it matter? You saw what he did to Destron. He's going to do the same to us. Broken branches? What happened here? Fondacia sacrificed Destron, allowing Merun's Dagon to drag us into his realm. Evelyn, I need the book you're carrying. You know about that? It's part of Dagon, just like Kalia and me. I sensed it the moment I met you. I think I can use it to weaken Vondasia. Give us a fighting chance. All right. What are you going to do with it? Take the fight to Vondasia in the courtyard. He won't expect that. Meanwhile, I need time to prepare. Go fight the super powerful Daedric priest? How? Just keep him busy. Then, with the help of this book, I'll take care of the rest. All right. Sombra needs us to buy him some time. Let's get to the courtyard. A fortress. Its very stone crumbles in my presence. Keep going. There's still cultist blood in the oh, Help me! No! Pathetic. Are those arrows or flea bites? of you. Stop what is happening! Get ready, Kalia! Just like I showed you! You're going to pay, Bundy! This is for my brother! You dare! Merging the realms is delicate. One mistake and both would be destroyed.
wanted our power! Here! You can't avoid your fate's ambitions! did it. We stopped Vondasia from merging the realms and opening the way for Mayrune's Dagon. But my brother, Destron is still dead. I failed Destron, but I won't fail you. All right, 
Without Vandacia, I can't believe it. We defeated Vandacia, saved Sombrin and Kalia, and sent Dagon running with his tail between his legs. Yeah, I guess Varro Lucas was right. We did need that strange book. In fact, I think I was meant to give it to Sombrin. I Sombrin did good, that's for certain. And honestly, I'm glad to be rid of that book. Sombrin. Now I can add facing down a Daedric Prince to my already impressive list of accomplishments. Food connoisseur, master assassin, consummate Vosa Saddle player, and now this. Nope. Vandacia made this personal, but I try not to make a habit of killing people for free. It's bad for business. Hey, I never claimed to be a hero. And despite our success today, I don't want to face Daedric threats on a regular basis. About Destron. I'm still alive. I can't believe I survived all that, but Destron didn't. Easy to say. Hard to do. Still, I hope so. Not just for my sake, but for the other ambition, whoever they are. I've been alone my entire life. First in my vault, then in my wanderings. I finally found a real family. And I let one of them get taken from me. For now. But I don't think it's over. There's another ambition to find. And I can't imagine Mehrun's Dagon and his followers leaving us alone after all the time. I, uh... I'm not sure. It belongs to Evely, not me. I'd like to study it. See if there's some way to free the ambitions and change our destiny. Daedra spin great lies from small truth when it suits them. I know that now. It was Zaina's last lesson to me. Yes, I wonder who he is, or she. Are they still trapped inside a vault? Or did they find a way to escape like I did? Right, I almost forgot about that. The people of Blackwood owe you their gratitude, mercenary. You and Evely both. It could have been worse. We did well against the cultists. They were not trained soldiers. And when Mehrun's Dagon appeared, we faded into the mud and grass. When a fire rages, my neighbor's hut is my own. That is Argonian wisdom. We... Governor Keshu made the right call bringing the ambitions here. Can you imagine what would have happened to Gideon if Mehrun's Dagon appeared over the egg and hammer? That seems to be the long and short of it. I'm sorry we couldn't stop Vandacia from murdering Destron, but at least we took care of that rotten tree stump in the end. Dis that would be too much to hope for. I'm sure some of them slipped away. Not by myself, I didn't. You helped. What started as an historic mystery turned into a tale of murder, living Daedric weapons, and the end of the world. What now? Can't we just rest for a while and bask in the glory? I know, there's another ambition out there. I have a feeling you hate this sort of thing, but we need to head back to Gideon. Governor Keshu insists on throwing us a victory celebration. Oh, the best kind. I hear Governor Keshu really knows how to throw a party, Sure. The gardens behind the governor's mansion are big enough to entertain an entire army. I'll meet you in Gideon after you collect Sombrin and Kalia from the temple. I Absolutely. I think I'm really cut out for it.
What do you want? Hello? If you're looking for our guests, they're long gone. I know you. You brought those guests to our temple. Kalia and... I did say that, didn't I? I suppose that even the charms of the Lady of Love can be too much for some folk. I heard them talking about a ruin north of Gideon. I know that particular place well. But let me... I just came by to... I came by to find out what was keeping you in the ambitions. A ruin? I wonder why they went there. Have a... Lead on then. The party's going... Well? How much longer, Sombran? This place makes me feel uneasy. Not long now. I'm almost... Uh, oh, it seems we have company. I told Sombran we should have talked to you before coming out here. He wanted to try something with the book. Away from other people, just in case. Sombran doesn't think so. He says that's the last place they'd look for us. Worse? I suppose that depends on your perspective. I'm actually glad you found us. I didn't want to leave without an explanation. But I'm afraid that Callie doesn't have a lot of time. Callie's power is recharging faster than I anticipated. It will soon reach the point where I won't be able to help her. Use the Mysterium Zarxis to open a portal to the Deadlands? It's the only place I can think of where Callie will be safe. It's a big place. Zaina taught me how to avoid notice there. And... Poor Callie. I hope Sombran's right and he can help her. Hey, it wasn't my book. I was just keeping it safe for... Well, as crazy as it sounds, I think I was meant to give it to Sombrin. We go to the party. It's taking place in the gardens behind the governor's mansion. To think, this all started because I was curious about a coded journal I found in Emperor Leovic's old retreat. I'll see you at the party. Last one there doesn't get any cake. Yeah! Sounds delicious, assassin. You must leave me a copy of the recipe. Welcome to the celebration, mercenary. There are many here who wish to thank you and share a drink or two. Choosing exile to spare others from danger is a noble decision. I wish anyone you like. They have all come to show you their appreciation. And... So this is what it's like being the hero everyone looks up to? 
Most of the stories I've read end with a hero riding off into the sunset before anyone can properly thank them. I don't know about that, but I certainly feel more experienced. And I have you to thank. Well, you and Captain Rianne and Governor Keshu and poor Farrell Lupus. That's right, I almost forgot. And we should be ready to help Sombrin and Kalia when they return. I don't... Here, your share of the last of our compensation from Leowin. And a little something. Welcome, people of Blackwood and honored friends. We have weathered a terrible storm. So now, we celebrate. Many had a hand in this victory, including those who gave their lives for our cause. But I want to honor the two heroes beside me. Without them, all would have been lost. So stand tall and raise your cups to the sky. Remember those who fell and praise the deeds of those who lived. To victory!